Stay right where you are because I've got an amazing little treat for you. Let's go. This review is on the Volvo D1 disposable pods. And I'm telling you, they're amazing. I always take six of these pods for the purpose of a review by EC Click. Check them out, the link's below. There's also a link to my written review below. Awesome guys, great website. Every review, they're awesome. Check them out. Also, these little beasts are 50 milligram. So if you're in a TPD area, these aren't available because TPD specifies you're not allowed nicotine higher than 20 milligram. Sorry guys. This little beauty is 23 wide by 13 thin by 75 mil tall. About the same size as the wire to be fair. It's 28 grams, that's carrying 1.2 mil liquid, a 240 milliamp hour battery, and we reckon that's going to be 250 puffs, which is equivalent to 20 fags because it's 50 milligram. It's got overtime vaping protection, which I think is overheat protection, short circuit protection, and low voltage protection. It comes in six different flavors. You've got tobacco, mint, blueberry, green apple, mango, and melon. Well, that's enough of this malarkey. Let's go in my opinions. Let's go. Out of all, my, all the flavors, the melon's massively my fa favorite, but they're all pretty decent flavors. The only one that I weren't so keen on is the mint, because I don't think it tastes like mint, I think it just tastes like menthol. The tobacco flavour amazes me, tobacco usually tastes like tobacco rather than cigarette smoke. But that's not the case with those though, it actually tastes like a cigarette. I even asked a mate that smokes, and they've said it tastes exactly like a fag. A cheap fag mind you, but a fag nonetheless. They also have an LED indicator. That lights up when you take a puff, also when the pods run out, it flashes several times to let you know it's expired. Run out of liquid, run out of battery. I don't quite know which one it does first, if any. I, I don't need dry hits. Like I said, it takes a maximum of 250 puffs, which kind of puts me off a little bit because it doesn't tell you how much to expect. It just tells you it gets a maximum, which I understand why we do that, but in my eyes, come on, tell me I'm going to get 5 puffs, 10 puffs, 100 puffs, 200 puffs, what? But. On the test I did, one got 236, and the other one got 224, I think. So it's quite decent. They seem to last me probably 10 hours, 12 hours, and I'm using them quite a lot. Too much, in my opinion, for a 50ml. But they're decent. Something that might pull up a cloth is the branding. It's quite big on the product. But as you can see, I think they'll be quite blank without it, and I do think it looks quite good. So there you go, guys. The conclusion is they are awesome. They're obviously only disposable, but I, I said on the written review, if these were available in the UK, I would be buying one every time I went on that, uh, rather than taking my device. It's not too harsh in your throat, not too not. It is very much like smoking a fag apart from it tastes better, apart from that one because it actually tastes like a fag. It tastes better. And it's not too tight of a draw, but it's not loose. You can probably pull a direct lung in. I don't recommend it because it's 50 watts, but you can do it if you really try. However, they are designed for mouth to lung, and we do that quite well. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to press the thumbs up. Don't forget to share it. Make sure you subscribe, ring the bell, all that malarkey. And most of all, don't forget to stay cloudy.